On Tuesday, February 19th, Hopkinton Hillers boys basketball had their regular season finale against the Wayland Warriors. Both teams entered the game with 13 wins and 6 losses, and rumor had it that this matchup will be a playoff matchup as well, and the winner of this game gets home court advantage. First quarter, Wayland outscored Hopkinton 19-12. Xander Livingston netted 10 points in the quarter for the Warriors in the second quarter. Stephen Maffiori netted a pair of threes, and Brendan Kelly racked up a couple of field goals to help the Hillers outscore Wayland 20-14 in the quarter. Wayland led at the half 33-32. Recently hopped into the game. Keep driving up for the Hillers. Over to Lind, up for three. Count oh. it. Making it rain. Wow. Brendan Kelly continued his low post dominance in the third quarter, knocking down four field goals and helping the Hillers outscore Wayland 18 to 13. Hillers led after the third, 50 to 46. Hillers up by three. 123 and counting left to go in the third. Over to Kelly, great feed. Oh. Can't finish. Loose ball, Kelly sticks with it, off the window and in! Five seconds and counting, left in the third, up for three, no good there by Davies, collected by Kelly. Here comes the Hillers over to Ambrosoni, he's gonna pull up, oh, great yeah. move there, oh, count it! Jabari Nurse netted nine points for Wayland in the fourth quarter, but it would not be enough as the Hillers outscore Wayland in the quarter 13 to 11 and take the game by a final score of 63 to 57. The Hillers finish the regular season with 14 wins and six losses and will next compete in the playoff tournament. According to a number of sources, there is a good chance the Hillers will get a visit from Wayland once again to begin postseason play. In the game, Stephen Maffiori and Brendan Kelly netted 19 points apiece. Ryan Kester contributed 9 points. Brendan Kelly also had 11 rebounds in the victory. A big congratulations goes out to Hopkinton Hillers head coach Tom Keane as this win over Wayland was his 250th career win at the helm for the Hillers. Congratulations, Coach Keene.